Hey guys, this is my fourth attempt at making this video. I don't know why, but it keeps cutting me off. So I'm going to go back. Hopefully I can go a little bit slower this time. Maybe I will have enough memory for that. Okay, I went back to my first dollar box because I didn't update you on that one. I used the Jane Airedale Just Kiss Limp Plumper in Rio. I really liked it. The feel was nice, the color was nice, and it plumped. Benefit Professional, um... Professional. I've used before. I really like their products um, and I use it under my makeup. It makes it go on easier. Marc Jacobs Daisy Dream. Love the smell. Um, Illum Tonka Noor Candle. Noor Candle. I'm not good at um, those words. <laughs> uh, anyway, the candle's nice. I used over half of it. The smell is great. Bumble and Bumble. Hairdresser's Invisible Oil. I really liked. I've already used almost all of that. Um, it doesn't smell weird and it doesn't weigh my hair down at all. The Saint Pola Lavender Chamomile Body Lotion I really liked. Um, the smell of that one and the way it felt. The second Olor Box I've used the um, Jan uh, John Frieda 7 Day Volume. I really liked that. I'm gonna purchase um, the full size on that one. It's the leave in shower treatment that lasts for seven days. I felt like it did thicken my hair up and, and volumize it a little bit. Um, the Julep Lip Gloss and Graceful I have on right now and I like the way it feels, the way it tastes, all of that. Um, nice color, just kind of sheer color. The Versace Eros Perfume. Um, I like the smell of that a lot. I probably will buy a full size of that as well. The um, Avene Thermal Spring Water um, Skin Quenching Water Spray. <laughs> Um, I really liked that. I've never used one, but I like the way it felt, especially after I got a little bit burnt last week. Um, I really probably will go out and buy a big one of those. The Laneige Water Sleeping Mask. Really liked that. Had never tried a water mask. Really thought that was nice. Um, Alternate Caviar Repair Multivitamin Heat Protecting Spray. I just used that today. I like, uh, pretty much everything about that. The... It smoothed my hair down and, and it I feel like it, it does what it says it'll do. The newest dollar box that I just got is this little guy right here. Um, in it, the St. Tropez Self Tanning Express. Self Tanner. I've never had good luck with self tanners before. I used this one. It says to leave it on for an hour if you want a light, two hours if you want medium, and three hours if you want dark. I left it on all three hours and I'm not real impressed. At least it didn't turn me orange, uh, it, it, it doesn't smell bad or anything, but I, $44 for a full size, I don't really feel like it changed my color all that much, so I probably, I'm kind of up in the air on that one actually, uh, I might give it one more chance, and there's enough in, in the sample size they give you to do two applications. The Isola Perfect Ending Leave-In Conditioner. I really liked that. I used that today also. The smell is fantastic and I like the way it feels. It's very lightweight. Um, the e.l.f. Studio Small Stifling Brush. I used that to put on one of my um, honey masks today and I really liked it. Um, I like the way it helped put it on and I, I will use it with foundation and let you know how that went eventually. Um, the nail polish. The Lauren B. Beauty Nail Couture in Polo is very cute. I don't know if you can see the color real well but um, I like it. I'm gonna give it a chance. I haven't done that yet. Um, the Completely Bare um, Wax Strips for Face, Bikini, and Body. I really liked. I've tried wa you know, wax strips before and they didn't work. The, the pre-wax ones, you just heat them up in your hand. Um, I had a lot of failure with that. So I was surprised when this one actually did work. So um, I'll probably buy a full set of that also. The Cots Face Sunscreen SPF 40 in Natural Skin Tone. This little guy. Um, I like that. I put that on today. I don't have any makeup on other than that. It's just like a tinted um, tanner for your face. Uh, I liked that and I will definitely probably buy that one also. Um, one other thing that has nothing to do with Allure but I'm like so excited about. I have never tried eyebrow dye. So my friend Lisa and me went to I think Rite Aid and we bought it and I did not have to pencil my eyebrows at all, which for me is like crazy because I do it every day. So um, it just darkened them. You can leave it on as long as you want. I can't remember the brand. When I buy another box, I'll show that also, even though it has nothing to do with lore. But 
I don't know, I figured there's people out there probably looking for the same thing, and I was a little afraid to try it at first, but my friend tried it before I did, about a week before me, and I saw the results, and I wanted to try it, and I really liked it. So I'll let you know what brand that was when I get another bottle. Other than that, uh, sorry it took me so long to review the products from before. Next time I'm going to try and do it the way I did it this time, where I'm going to use them first, instead of just doing the unveiling or unopening or whatever you want to call it of the alert box. I thought for me getting on here and making another video would be great but I think it for me works better if I just open it use it and, and let you know what's in the box and how I liked it. So um, that's all for today and I hope you have a good day. Thanks.